What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. This is Mary and your girl and I am super excited to be here as always. If you're new here, you're welcome. If you were my subscriber, I really do appreciate you. So let's move right into the gist of today. Hmm, what's today's gist? Okay, things that could actually push your Nigerian man into cheating or that could actually push your Nigerian man away from you even when he wasn't actually intending to do that but because of your behavior or because of your character or your non-challenged attitude towards these things you actually push him out not even knowing you did that so I will break some of them down for you so that you can bring yourself back if you feel like you're going astray number one thing that will make your nigerian man really 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 cheat on you you're lazy to cook for him yeah this is true cooking is very important to a nigerian man if you are lazy to cook for him and your man meets someone else who makes his tummy happy who makes his tummy smile who makes him feel so good after eating the food then I'm sorry I don't know like there's a saying in Nigeria there's this tribe that actually really 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 knows how to cook not only do they know how to cook they also know how to do the other one <laughs> so there is this saying that if your man meets a calabar woman then I'm sorry for you because she would give double delicacy to him girl please can you not scream because she would give double delicacy to him and you would actually now go looking for your man do not let do not ever let a calabar woman get hold of your man we believe that as Nigerians I don't know if it's true but I think it's true second thing that would actually make your man cheat on you aside not cooking for him is feeling nonchalant after giving birth feeling lazy to put yourself together after giving birth so as a woman who has given birth you're supposed to take care of yourself do not say because oh yes I have given birth and now my, my, my position is solidified I now have a baby for him he's now the father of my child and then you start to act very very nonchalant about your looks about your dressing about your weight about what you put in your mouth about how you look you forget to look fly for your man you forget to package yourself <laughs> and then he goes out to see another packaged lady of course I'm not saying that he's going to do this to you but I'm just saying the simple fact of not looking your best or not looking put together just because you have given birth actually actually annoys them how can you just because you give birth to a child or two and you start looking like Humpty Dumpty or you start looking like an old woman excuse me even if you are fat there is fat with a difference package yourself if you were a size 10 and you become a size 12 or size 14 still package yourself still try try your best look your best the most important thing is looking your best it's not even the weight that you put on per se because of course you will put on weight but then if you try to get back and it's taking some time it's fine but just try to look your best you know just try to look your best like in the good old days you shouldn't announce to the world oh look I'm a mama now I'm a mama now stop that behavior of I'm a mama now yeah look yeah sweetie yeah that's true I just said that yes my love I just said that you see treasure just said it she said looking good is good business mommy <laughs> I love you sweetie I love that you understand what I'm saying so this he still wants to see you look fly he still wants that his girlfriend that he used to know 
it doesn't matter if you give birth or not so this is something else that could actually push your nigerian man out so think about it next time you're acting nonchalant acting lazy you don't care just because you give birth to one child or two think about it do not push that man out okay there are lots and lots and lots of beautiful women out there on the street looking so fly and they see them every day so do not let them do not let them i repeat do not let them be carried away and so something else you should know that could push your Nigerian man out is that horrible smell that welcomes him back every day he comes back from work. Okay, home is not conducive. The home is not like a home for him. Your home is not conducive enough for him. The smell from your home drives him out. You know, like I always say, we Nigerians were trained to do house chores. We don't wait on nannies. We don't wait on maids. We wait on ourselves. We do our things ourselves. If we get extra help, it's good. If we don't have any help, we still go ahead to do the chores ourselves. There is no excuse. You cannot give any excuse. You cannot say because you are this or you are that, you are tired. No. Cut it off. So men have also been trained to enjoy this cleanliness or this this chores that we do so that when a nigerian man goes dating because he's dated nigerian ladies he knows how the home is actually kept so imagine a man who dated me and i'm that lady who does the house chores keeps the house neat keeps the kitchen tidy sure the house is tidy he comes to visit and he makes a clean home he makes a wonderful meal prepared by me he uh, he makes a very you know there's something about a home it is welcoming but when a man comes into your home and the home is constantly dirty and he's so used to staying in a clean home because he's used to being around people who do the home cleaning and keeps the home clean all the time. What do you expect? If he goes out to meet another lady who keeps the home tidy and he feels more comfortable in that lady's house, he will constantly go to visit that lady because he feels comfortable there. I have someone who once told me he liked coming to my room in the university because I had a very welcoming room. Because the room was so welcoming that whenever he comes, he feels at home. That the cleanliness, the, 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 the air, everything about my room feels good for him. And that's why he loves to come to my room. Can you imagine that? So it's the same way your boyfriend will go to visit someone else or would meet someone by chance and just love the cleanliness around that person. And then that will push him to them. So what I'm saying in essence is keep the home clean. Do not let the smell from the home drive your man out. That is something else that could make your Nigerian man cheat on you. Something else that would make your Nigerian man trust you is the fact that he doesn't trust you or he knows that you're cheating and he knows. So because he knows you're cheating already and he says to himself, okay, what am I to gain anyway? She's cheating. So this relationship is going nowhere and he turns you into his girlfriend material not his wife material girlfriend material anything can go <laughs> if you don't understand the differences between a wife material and a girlfriend material please watch my video on that yes you will see how a nigerian man views his relationships he has the girlfriend material and he also has the wife material in the relationship so in essence what i'm saying is he will just fix you in his girlfriend material and she's cheating anyway is fine and still go ahead to get his wife material and finally the final thing that will actually actually make your nigerian man cheat on you is the fact that he decides that you are not his wife material or 
you are not what he wants in a woman and instead of just going out right to break up with you he will just actually look for someone else and when he gets that person he will be on his way to breaking up with you so my dears here you have actually things that would make a nigerian man cheat on you and as you can see they are all things that can be avoided so if you if you can actually avoid all these things which is so simple like keeping clean uh taking care of your home cooking what else very easy that's basically it taking care of yourself taking care of your home that's just it then you have your man so do not forget to keep a nigerian man to you you have to keep all this in mind that he is very 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 homely person being a nigerian just makes you a homely person so for you to keep him close to your heart close to yourself and not to go out cheating try to keep him as much as home as you can possibly by keeping the things or keeping the home clean cooking for him doing things that you should do believe me this way you will have him unto yourself so thanks for watching guys do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel it's still me malicious your girl to have a happy day bye